guys, it's me Kate again. But you won't believe, but this is my TBR for two more readathons happening in the month of May. Both, I think, throughout the entire month. I'll leave the information down below. So, the first is our. Arietiaton. I hope I'm pronouncing it correctly. It's based based on the movie, and you have twelve prompts, uh, uh, and uh, a bonus one. So let's begin the. First prompt is to read a uh, for uh, Ariete to read a uh, book with a strong female heroine. heroine. For that, I'll be rereading The Ladies' Guide to Petticoats and Pirates by Mackenzie Lee. The second book in the Gentleman's Guide to Guides, Rights and Virtue series. In this one, we're for, uh, in the first one, we're following Monty, who He's just about to go on to his grand tour with his best friend Percy, who he may or may not be in love with, and his sister Felicity. But on the grand tour, not everybody, everything goes as planned. And in this one, we're following Felicity after their return from the tour. Then we have show a book featuring an illness. Um, I think this one uh, we have Witch Pad by Lisa Kitsi, which is first book in Kitsune Chronicles. In this one we are following Sebastian who is a Kitsune, which is a uh, Japanese nine-tailed fox spirit. Uh, and uh, he's been around for a year because a year ago something happened. And he's been on the run until now and he bumps into an alpha werewolf named Lamb who actually saved him a year ago. This doesn't have like a normal illness, it has supernatural illness and uh, representation, representation for anxiety and depression. Then we have a homely a bull featuring mental health. I'll, for that I'll use A Court of Scholar Flames by Sarah J. Mass. In this one we're following uh, this fourth book in Court of Thorns and Roses series in which we are following a uh, girl named Fair who one day while hunting for uh, his, uh, her family accidentally kills a free wolf whose boss then comes and takes her to his court. And stuff goes from there. In this one, we're following her older sister Nesta, who is struggling with her mental health after the events of the third book. Then we have Pod to read a book with a strong adventure. For that, I'll be rereading Girl Online on tour by Zoe Sag. The second book in the Girl Online series, in which we are following Penny, who after a particularly embarrassing incident in school goes to New York with her parents to the wedding they're planning and there she meets nines, their, their women. In this one she goes on tour across Europe. So then we have Haru uh, to read a book with a mischievous character. I think it, this doesn't get more accurate than this. I will be reading Harry Potter and the Order of the Phoenix. They always get in trouble. Then we have uh, Spiller has warrior elements. For that, uh, I'll be. Uh, this is stretching it. I'll be rereading on this Black Sands by uh, Vanessa Rasen. And this one we're following Galofi, who is heir to the council, which is this governing body in this city. And uh, one day she figures out the, the council might not 
B was she believed it was and runs away and then we have Captain Declan McCallion he's a pirate and he is looking for a dagger that Council has been uh, hiding and the elf just can't help him. Then we have a Mia a book featuring animals. For that I'll actually be doubling up in Harry Potter and Order of Phoenix we have several owls, a cat, a toad, and I cannot remember what else. Then we have a teapot, a shiny cover. I don't know how well you can see, but uh, that was uh, uh, this water is a little bit, uh, it looks like it has sparkly uh, uh, color on it. Then we have a uh, flower, toy the color, a uh, book with co uh, colorful cover for that. I'll be also using it online on tour because I cannot uh, read 12 books in month of May. Of course, if I read these ones, I'll add just that they're so on. Then I have Sugar to read the book from my favorite daughter. For that, I'll be using also Court of Silver Flames with RGMS. Then I have the Bala Love to read a book featuring a forest. Oh. Oh, which blood oh, there is a forest. And we have a um, hair clip to read a book featuring a strong friendship. Um, ladies guide to, uh, the Ladies Guide to Petticoats and Piracy by Mackenzie Lee has a strong friendship. And then the bonus prompt is to read a book uh, that's a sweet middle grade or has a pink cover. For that I'll be reading Boris Kedemic Paul and F. Pub, which is Middle grade book by Sanya Pollock. This is, I don't know which one in Paulina Puck companion like series. Where we're following this girl Paulina Puck in her day to day life. Um, and it, all the books are in the form of a diary. Then we have our My Royal Read It on TBR. Uh, first prompt is. Mulan and Shang read a book with LGBTQIA plus rap. For that, I'll be using Witch Blood, Witch Blood uh, by Lisa Casey. Uh, Sebastian is gay. Liam is either a bi or pan. He doesn't actually put the label on it, and there are at least two openly out gay characters in this. Then we have Ariel and Derek uh, to read a book with uh, sailors or mermaids on this black sands by Vanessa Rosen and features pirates. Then we have Belle and the Beast, a book to read a book with uh, forest proximity. For that I'll be rereading Aurora Burning by Amy Kaufman and Jake Christoph, which is second book in Aurora Cycle and Sequel to Aurora Rising. In this series we're following Squad 312, which is basically uh, a band of misfits because their squad leader Tyler Jones was late to his graduation ceremony uh, because he was having a girl named Aurora. And instead of picking out best of the best, he ends up with bottom of the barrel. And now he, now it's up to our band of misfits to save a galaxy. And it's a force, force proximity as they all, as they uh, uh, spent most of their, their time in their spaceship. There was not a lot of space in a spaceship. Then we have Aurora and Prince Philip, a book with a secret or forbidden love. For that, I'll be rereading The Night Circus by Erin Morgenstern. 
this book in this book we're following two magicians who are competing against each other in this night circus which only appears at night without a warning and during the day it's closed and um, our magicians don't know who each other is and so they're basically trying to outdo each other and uh, uh, they are falling in love and then we have Rapunzel and Flynn to read a book with uh, adventure for <laughs> the lady's guide to pet goats and piracy piracy they are telling literally uh, or through two continents I, yeah they are even at one point uh, and at the north of Africa. So then we have uh, Tiana and Naveen to read a book uh, with enemies to lovers. A Court of Thorns and Roses by Sarah J. Mess on enemies to lovers trope. Then we have uh, Cinderella and Prince Charming a book with a ball or a party a girl online on tour I think they're on a party at one point in this but I'm not completely sure I don't remember and then we have Anna and Christoph a book that makes you laugh Harry Potter and Order of the Phoenix I don't know why but these books are hilarious to me so yeah that's it for this video. I'm sorry it has been a little hectic. If, but if you enjoyed it, please like, share and subscribe. Down below you have my social media, my email and some other stuff including... I think I will leave the Twitter accounts for both of these. And yeah, that's it. I'll see you in the next one.